So I don't know what's in it, but it's nasty stuff. So. <laughs> set up on this big block Chevy just went down through that cylinder it's 60 over this is the first cylinder I've done on this block so I have to measure it you see how it came out might have to adjust the cutter to compensate if it's too tight still or too loose hopefully it's just right but that's part of the fun part of setting these up. That's what it looks like on the block. I'll check this one out here real quick. Or a cylinder. Got the cutter above the deck. Now it's not locked in gear. Need to lock it in gear. It's right there. It's hard to do with one hand. Now it's in gear. Will not turn. Now, power switch. In the automatic feed. I'll start to turn there too. Try to blow the chunks down in the cylinder. Cast paws get down inside the cylinder. The chunks don't fly out the top of the bed. Well, some do.
Coast Bomber, you feel me? One cylinder, and a bunch of other blocks. Need to take it out of gear, lock the automatic feed, bring the bar back up, the cutter back up. The other cylinder's done. On to the next. Now the block set up, ready to hone. With the honing plate on, it's all torqued down, ready to go. But I can't get started because I have no honing oil. I have to go get some. Probably do that here in the next half hour. Probably get something to eat. Hopefully, don't get any more spit burgers. And then once this block's honed, it's done. I got one more to do after this. And on this little run of block boring, I did five big block chibis. Last one's a big block too, so that'll be six total. All I know is everybody likes says it's the grind, it's the grind, it's the call it the home. At least when you're grinding you get something to accomplish. <laughs> Honing sucks. Be nice to have an automatic machine that does it for you, but I don't have that kind of money. If anybody has one that they'd like to send me, I'd sure take it. I got the block done. Just bored 60 over. Going with a deck plate, torque plate. Tops of the cylinders are chamfered. Now I gotta get the owner to come pick it up. I got one more to do. This should be done for a while. I got pruning hands to prove it. Put those rubber gloves due to your hands. At least mine anyways. My hands sweat like mad with them on. But I'm not touching that honing oil at all. That stuff's nasty. Get that on you. It starts to burn and make your skin tingle. So I don't know what's in it, but it's nasty stuff. So. 